Activity three, procedure. I have this opened up from our text that is linked on our slides. The procedure here says, refer to student sheet 3.1, three level reading guide. I have transferred this three level reading guide into questions on your slides. You do not need to worry about student sheet 3.1. Um, any interaction and writing of um, questions will be on the slides themselves. Follow your teacher's instructions for how to use the stop and think questions. The stop and think questions will be on each slide. Each slide is a new stop and think question. I am going to begin the first section of reading down to the first stop and think question. You may listen along. I would encourage you to look at the videos or the videos, the images while I am reading. Reading asexual reproduction. There are two basic kinds of reproduction, asexual and sexual. Some organisms can reproduce both ways while other organisms can only use one of the two kinds of reproduction. If you completed the cell biology unit of issues in life science, side note, we did this last year, you learned about bacteria and other microorganisms. These organisms reproduce asexually. In asexual reproduction, a single-celled organism, such as a bacterium or an amoeba, reproduces by dividing in two. See figure on the right, this one right here. Each new offspring produced, called an offspring, is identical to the parent cell. If you see a word in bold here, please note that these are vocabulary terms that you should know. Next week, we will start combining these vocabulary terms into a vocabulary, um, I want to say flip book, but more of a vocabulary slideshow with images and definitions. So stop to think number one. In asexual reproduction of a bacterial cell, is it clear which of the two cells produced is the parent and which is the offspring? So we have our parent, it splits into two and we're left with two offspring. Can we tell which one was the original parent? Can we tell which one's our new offspring? Is this possible? Explain. So you're going to have to think about the reading. Use the image here. We have one parent. We have two offspring based on this picture and what we read about. Can you tell between these two cells which one was the parent and which one was the offspring? Explain. So pause the video. Think about it. Go back through the reading. Look at the picture and answer the stop and go question.